Hey guys, it's Matt here again. Um, this is gonna be my third Photoshop tutorial video. I hope you like the other two. Um, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make the star vector technique for like banners, design, site models on MySpace, all that good stuff. Um, it's really easy to make. Anyone can do it as long as you have Photoshop. You can make about two minutes flat. All right, so here we go. What you're gonna want to do is get a new file going. I have it set to 300 by 500 pixels. Press OK. And leave it at white. So it'll look the best that way. Alright, so now what you want to go, what you want to do is go to your gradient tool right there. And I have the colors chosen to like an aqua color and a lime green color. Make sure you have both of these, both the foreground and the background colors. A color that you like and make sure they're not the same color because then you won't see the effect so we're gonna hold down shift and draw our line right in the middle about and let go so there we have our gradient right there next what we want to do is go to filter distort and wave so I have my settings preset already and these are this is what I like but it's all personal preference um, as you can see right here it almost looks like a wallpaper kinda look to it um, you want the straight lines because that's the only way it'll work with the uh, with the star vector it's the best way it'll come out so you want those straight lines going up and down um, my settings are set to 70 19 20 1 145 100 100 the type I have on square and the undefined areas I have at repeat edge pixels so if you want yours to look like mine uh, does at the final finish uh, just put your settings like this so press OK and you have your lines going up and down right there so next what you want to do is go to filter distort and polar coordinates and as you can see you have your star vector look right there make sure it's on rectangular to polar and not polar to rectangular because then the whole effect just goes away and it's not there so leave it at rectangular to polar press ok and there you have your star vector uh, background you know for your designs and anything else you want Hope you liked the video. If you do, please subscribe, send comments. Um, if you want, if you want to know anything else, have any video requests, just let me know, and I'll get your videos up for you as soon as I can. Um, otherwise than that, thanks for watching.